Well, okay, I couldn't stop myself. I um, just gave it a bit of a clean up for the moment and uh, threw some strings on it just to see what would happen. Okay, so what we have here is, could be as early as 65, most likely it's a 71, maybe 72. It's just no, there is no way of knowing. I haven't quite deciphered how the serial numbers run uh, yet, and it seems to be a complex issue with harmonies. But uh, anyway, it's a classic American harmony, sovereign, got it in uh, the Hallgate uh, Caution auctions for a very reasonable price and all I've done is cleaned it so far but the anomaly is that it's got a pin bridge and not a thread through bridge so a little bit more investigation has shown that in fact there was one American luthier who specialised in doing conversions the reason why there are so few sovereigns in good condition around these days is very simple these were not like the top of the range guitars they were not spoken about in the same way as Martins or Gibsons. They sounded lovely, they played nicely, uh, they got quite thick, chunky necks, and uh, they were made very flimsily. So uh, many years ago, I was at the Iron Horse uh, fantastic venue in Massachusetts, Northampton, Massachusetts. Next to it, there's a classic guitar shop. So I went in to look around, had a chat with the chap, and I said, why do you see not see any Harmony Sovereigns around? He said, well, they've all collapsed, folded up, died. You know, they all bellied here. You know, they just broke up, basically. So apparently there was a luthier who used to uh, buy Harmony Sovereigns and he would do his own uh, extra work on them and he put a pin bridge instead of a, a thread-through bridge. And I haven't got the device into which to actually look inside the bracing yet, but apparently he improved the bracing, which then made the guitars uh, kind of a bit more durable, basically. So it's the first one I've ever seen. I've got two, two others. They've got thread through bridges. Steve Knightley's got a very beautiful sort of 1973-74 sunburst one, which is in fabulous condition. And that's a thread through bridge. So um, anyway, that solves that anomaly. Uh, someone, however, at a much later point has put terrible nut on it so that's the first thing to go a couple of the heads here are completely shagged so they'll have to be replaced and uh, but here's the the real uh, the absolutely amazing mistake is that of course it's there's a you know there's a it's a gently curved gent, gently curved fretboard and someone's put a completely flat bridge on it so the feel of it is uh, well, the action's perfectly usable just like this, although I, once I've... Uh, I just did this, uh, put the strings on it to see what it was actually like, but um, I will take the strain off it and uh, we'll give it a chance. Um, after I put it down, I'll take it down a tone and leave it like that just to see what happens. But I think it's going to hold up very well. Yep. Even with full strain, there's no sign of anything going on here. But they have a certain sound. <laughs> It's, uh, it's not bad, you know. I've just seen that's a, it's really a, it feel, they always feel like flat picking guitars to me. I've just seen a place and I can pick it in the time or place where I'm just like you, just the girl to me. I want to the world to see me. Had it been another day, I might have looked the other way, but I would not have been where. As it is, I'll dream of the night. Na, 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 na. Falling, yes, I am falling, and she keeps going. I think this has um, huge possibilities, so uh, this is probably the best thing I've found uh, for ages. <laughs> Accuracy is a bit dodgy as well, but so then strap, strap it 
strings are already going, so... Uh... Yeah, that head's definitely knackered. I'm not the kind of man who tends to socialise I think that's that's how it feels to me um, yeah so uh, you know this stuff's out there folks it doesn't cost a fortune you've just got to make an effort go out and find it I think I may well keep this one I rather like it <laughs> 